I'm Knife of 29 and welcome to my channel. This is my custom interloper run. And here's what's in our backpack. Uh, we're boiling up some water right now. All our clothing is good. Uh, there's no Aurora tonight. There we go. Uh, we're on day 90. And here's all our skills. Archery is getting real close to number 4. Cooking is at 5. Everything else is moving up. So it's almost night time. So we're going to make, I think, one more batch of water. And, hmm. Is that going to be... Oh, that's going to be real close. And where's my bedroll? Right behind me. Alright, there we go. Uh, we'll just drink. We're at 2.5. And what do we got? Six hours till daylight. Let's do eight hours. See how that works. All right. So we're just going to eat some meat here. I think that should be good. Use a drink. And we got 12 sticks. I'm going to take that with us. I guess let's go look for the arrow. There should be a wolf on the ground somewhere. We're only one arrow down for the temperature. It's actually good. Oh, no. That was a wind block. <laughs> it is colder than I thought. So it's going to be way too windy. There won't be any crows to guide us. Uh, I was kind of wondering what I should be doing while I'm waiting for the wind to die down. I'll check my T's. What do I got for T's? Two and two. And we're all good. Got bunches of coffee. We have the moose bag, so we've already been here before. Um, I'm just thinking I'm not going to venture too far away from the cave right now. I think we'll go back in there, warm up, and then we'll head back out in that direction. I really have no clue where that wolf went to. Well, we got crows. They're finally appearing. Minus 21 wind and the crows are out. Okay. So I, I officially have no clue when the crows come out, when it's too windy. I thought it was maybe similar to torches being blown out. But it's not. Alright, so... Because of the signal void, having to go out at night, we'll just sleep for an hour. To help us warm up and take some more meat. 
Did we eat all of it? No, we didn't. So we're almost at uh, midday. So it's not those crows. That's that deer that we shot. Let's go see if we can find some crows out this way. Eh. I wonder if they changed the sounds because the, the the does aren't making that horrendous sound they used to make. I've been hearing that sound a lot more lately. The other sound they were making was kind of spooky. But I honestly don't remember when the last time I heard that sound was now. I guess we should grab the, grab a few sticks. While we're walking around. Yeah, I got no clue where that wolf went to. He has my arrow and if I mean, if I had something better to do right now, I wouldn't really care. But... I mean, I don't really have anything else I can be doing here. So we may as well look for him since, uh, I mean, I wonder if he, uh, he wouldn't have despawned. We only shot him yesterday. I hear bunnies or something. Not even hearing any crows. Oh, I am hearing some. Somehow, I don't think. I don't think those are for my uh, my wolf. Those are a little too high up. That's probably something on the ledge. Get down here. There we go. I don't really want to climb the rope. That'll just kill our alertness. I'll just continue this way. Maybe we get lucky. Wow, like where did he go? I have no clue. Way too early for him to have despawned.
Well, I guess we'll just wander around collecting sticks. And wait for the night. And, uh, hope for an aurora. again and go to Moose Outlook or Moose Overlook whatever it's called I don't really want to go there though I mean that's we already went there but we can go down there and over to the side I think that was an ice cave entrance that is over there Got enough sticks straight over on that little... Well, I guess it's more up in there. Got enough sticks to mark our path through the ice cave. Whew. Sure getting cold. And we should warm up when we're in there. you are that wolf. I really don't. Oh, we'll take that. Sounds like there's more crows, but I can't see where they're at. That's just the body if you crouch through that little area we passed. I better get inside. There we go. Cave made of ice. but it's warm. Hmm. Let's drop one. All right, let's go to the right. up our garbage. Oh, I've probably already marked these caves. Yes, I have. Hey, RA. Welcome in. Things are all good here, bud. How are you? I don't think I have any reason to really be in here and pick up my stick because this is a dead end. Yeah. If I marked it, I've clearly been in here already, so there's no real reason to go back. But... Can I uh, place my bedroll somewhere? Finish warming up with a nap. There we go.
could do with winning the lotto? Yeah, who couldn't, eh? Alright, I'll eat this meat. And we'll drink up some water. And I guess we'll get out of here. Still haven't found that wolf. I have no clue where that wolf with my arrow is. I'm starting to think he despawned and my arrow is just laying on the ground somewhere. So we're just kind of wandering around. We're kind of looking for the wolf, but not really. I mean, I don't really know what else I can be doing here during the daytime. So I figured we'd look for the wolf. So we're kind of just walking around collecting sticks at the moment. Nah, we won't go in there. I don't know if I want to climb that rope, but we might have to. We'll see. I can't remember if I can get out this way. not a terrible day today. It's only minus three. I think I can get out climbing that log. Let's go all the way and follow this and see where it goes. Yeah, that should take us out of here. You only went to the hushed bunker and straight out, yeah. Yeah, we're not going in there. <laughs> Let's strip down to get through that. We've already been in there anyway. That's the problem. I've already been here, right? So, like, the main areas, I think I've already kind of checked out, like, the caves and the signal fire. Looks like we can uh, crouch through this, I think. But where does this bring us? Get my bow out just in case. Now, oh, what's the time of day? Okay. And I really don't know where I'm at right now.
Oh, I kind of remember that little nook there. That doesn't mean I know where we're at. I just remember it. All right, we can put that away. We're not frightened rookies. Uh, I hear crows. Oh, look at you. What are you, a maple? Yes, you are. We'll take you. Put you in our cave. Alright, those wolves, or those crows are over there. Oh good, he got scared. I didn't really want to have to deal with a wolf. Scared him off right to some bunnies. Let's go up here if we can. You're over here. Oh, you're just a body. Have we checked you? No, we haven't. Perfect. Uh, we'll put those in the cave as well. Nice little doe up there. Any more feathers? Nope. Alright, it might be time to make a fire. Are you going to give me the wind block? Up a bit. With the book, we're at a hundred. That's good. we're actually warming up well a little bit I guess Let's just do this. We need the water, right? So... That's a good torch. We want you right there. Yes. Nice, nice. Alright, let's go. Before it gets too dark, I want to get back to my cave so I know where I'm at. Oh, 
Oh, there goes the torch. Because I really don't know any safe places other than in there, maybe. So I remember this little area here. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Not from this run, but I remember having a wolf, which is probably that guy that was way back there. I remember him following me. Alright, can't go that way. I should have drank a hot tea. But I was being too cheap, I wanted to have my two teas with me. You coming after me, bruh? Let's go. There you go. 3.9. Alright, we got archery 4. Now, to remember how to get down there. Well, it looks like I can billy goat. We'll find out. Oh yeah, this is a pretty easy one actually. Alright, and I think if I can find that fire, or that, that log, that was going up, I'm not sure I can carry much more. that might get us out of here. And it might be close enough. To where I know where I'm at. Alright, there it is. I think if we go up that log and we go that way, I think. Watch, I'll find out that I actually can't go up that log. You know what? There's a cave up here that doesn't have a waterfall. Let's just go in there. Ooh, a piece of coal. We'll definitely take that. Now where is that cave? There's the rope, so the cave is just right up here. I think right there. Well, from the sounds of it, I don't think we're going to get an Aurora tonight. I think I can use this. Oh, we got more coal. Good. Lots of coal. Lots and lots of coal. 
Wow. I'm going to use the lantern. Maybe there's another piece or two. Oh, there's a piece of wood. And we basically walked right over. Oh, there's a piece of coal. Alright, do I have food? No, I don't. Well, we gotta find our, uh, our cave. That's close enough. Let's get out of here. You know what? I think I'm just going to go back the way I got in here. Because I know how to get to the cave from there. Let's take you. So we can break you down. We'll run. I think we'll be sleeping through the night. I get a wind block over here? Probably not. Ah, great. The wind's coming right in our face. That's where we gotta go. Yeah, we got lots of coal in there. I think I had five. Maybe I had more. I don't remember. But we definitely got a lot. Uh, let's take these. Uh, we got another one right there. Do we have another one before I go into the cave? No. Alright, we'll just, uh... Make this up. Good enough. I think we'll make it to the our home cave. Well, maybe not. It's three arrows down, so maybe we won't. We'll start getting cold. But if I run. And we climb. Looking for another bushel of rose hips. 
We'll end up using those for our warm drinks. There's some. And there's some more. You can give them to me. There we go. There's some more. I know where I'm at. I think we got to go more that way. Because when we went down there the first time, we went, we went through that direction. the cave, Astrid. Did I say I hate being cold? Because I really do. Here we go. Shut her up, eh? All right. May as well harvest this. And why not harvest these as well? up these ruined torches. I think we'll drop a bunch of the sticks on the floor. Um, see, I did this stupid thing where I, I picked up all this charcoal and then I threw it down right by the fire. But that's a pretty prime looking area for wood. And do I have coal in here? No. Alright, we'll pick up uh, five pieces. And the charcoal can go over here. I don't really need it oh we have an extra knife now and extra torches are these the bad ones whoops those are the bad ones and these ones are the 30s And, you know what, I don't carry torches. Forty-five. Our good bow is down to forty-five now. That is incredible. Alright, let's put this away. 
We can have another look through this stuff. Uh, only make one. All right, what do we got? Oh, we got this branch. But you, I guess right there, you look pretty there. And probably put our bedroll down. And I guess we may as well sleep, right? You keep running out of charcoal? Yeah. If you're mapping, yeah, you need... But I'm not really mapping. Every once in a while, if if I get lost, I might map that location. Just to kind of gauge where I'm at. Uh, okay, I can't see. This is ridiculous. I know my... Well... Let's... Oh, there we are. All right, let's move this right there. We don't have to waste our lantern. So we're almost morning. Is there anything else we can really do? I can probably throw, well, I could, you know what? Where's my fire? There it is. 95, we should be okay. I guess that's already on there. I was looking for my piece of wood. Alright, we'll cook up as many of these teas as we can. Maybe make some water. How are we? We're at 92. And... I guess now we'll make the water. What do we got? 49? 26? It'll be just enough. If we do that... Six minutes, ten minutes. We can drink this, get a little bit of a heat buff. I didn't take my bedroll. That could be a very bad, 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 bad thing. Uh, pick up. And what do we got? We got the two pieces of meat. Alright, good. That ate all that one up. Well, I still have that second knife on me, so... Hmm. We've got another day to kill.
we took everything off of this guy, right? There's this point five. I don't know that there's too much reason, but you know what we could do is just go get ourselves another deer. What I'd like to do is try to scare that deer this way. Maybe we can get her over by our cave. Or at the very least, into a wind block area. Uh, she's going to run right away. Hopefully she runs left. Good girl. Spook her another time and then maybe when we catch up to her she'll be in a nice spot. That might be a pretty decent area right there. Oh that's not gonna it's not gonna work for her. That's not a bad spot either. I forget these does are extremely skittish. Oh, that's actually perfect. I don't know how far she ran though. Right there. Oh, I can't stand and shoot. Or crouch. Well, that's even better. She's going right to the cave. Her tracks just disappear. Oh, there she is. Nope, that's a bunny. <laughs> I thought it was the back end of her deer. Jesus, it's cold. Well, let's go warm up. There you are. All right, stop. Yeah, these does are extremely skittish. That's her right there. She's walking away. All right, let's go warm up. It's a goddamn freezing. She's probably going to walk back to her original location, but I'm kind of hoping she doesn't. Get a visit from your son and not, not after money. He's not after her. <laughs> nice.
Alright. Sounds like she's right on the other side of this rock. Or is that the sound of her running again? I hear her. Shut up, Astrid. We're listening. Oh, I can't wait till I get archery five and I can crouch and shoot. Oh, are you kidding me? This is not going very well. My fingers feel numb. Oh, I got her. All right, well, we're going to have to wait for her to go down. I liked it way better when she was way over here. Looking like we're gonna get a blizzard too. Hopefully it's just a bit of a snowstorm, that's it. Actually looks like it cleared up. Now is it crow weather? Still cold though. She should have went down by now too. an accelerant that's good where can she be she went this way but who knows where she went after that, right? Is that another sapling right there? It is. We'll take that. I 
All right, well, I'm not hearing any crows. And I'm not going to waste a fire just to warm up. Oh, I hear crows now. Oh, it's just you. Okay, those ones are out now. So it should be a little easier to find this girl over here somewhere. Maybe that's her. I hope so, because I would like to build a fire. Oh, that's probably that wolf, isn't it? Nope, that's our girl. Let's go get her. Just grab some sticks. All right, lady, I believe you have my property. There we go. That looks like a good spot. Uh, you know what? Let's do this. Um, it's too cold. I think. That's good. And we'll throw a piece of coal. That should bring the temperature. Okay, so we got an hour 21. An hour 14. Oh, okay. 39 minutes. Um, let's take another 0.5 and cook it right here. Yeah, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Yeah, we got 58 minutes. I should have actually, uh, Harvested the guts while that was cooking. Alright. How long for the hide? 24 minutes and we got 38 on the fire. Thank you very much, lady. And... We can go back. Minus 19 on the wind. I'll take uh, another thing of rose hips. That should give us 40 or 24. Okay, good. I 
Hey, Murdback, welcome in. We just bagged ourselves a deer. We didn't get an Aurora last night, so we're kind of killing today. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. And we needed a bit more meat to get us through, so... And I still haven't found that wolf that I, uh, that, that ran off with my arrow. And I'm thinking at this point he probably despawned somewhere. And that deer, that's a bear. Where is the safe spot? Whoop, hey, don't crouch. That's not a good thing to do. Uh, the deer we just harvested, my arrow was kind of embedded in the ground. Alright, we can get him and then he'll come up this way. Got him twice. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> That's not fair. Uh, I just hope my clothing is okay. And my bedroll. I hope he walks right past my cave and dies right in front of it. Right? I'm gonna have to stop that bleeding somehow. I'm gonna let him just walk. I'm sure I can carry much more. Because the further he walks that way... Oh, you... There you go. Uh, the cold is making my head feel thick. Do we have any other afflictions? No. So we got three arrows in him. The further the, he walks that way, the better it is for us. Do I, if I don't warm up soon. And I'm not going to be greedy. If he dies right where he's at, I'd be pretty happy. It's pretty good wind block there. Okay, well, he's far enough away. We got to warm up, so. What's the worst that can happen, right? We can uh, drag him closer to our cave this way. I need, oops, I need three of you. This might not be a bad tactic, because I'm pretty sure if I hit him one more time, he'll go down. But I gotta get warm. I 
I'm gonna keep the meat on me. And we'll just wait. And hopefully he comes. Hopefully. All right, we're warm enough that we should be able. Uh, where's all my sticks? Oh, I got that. All right, he's getting close. The wolf just got scared. Got 10 sticks. We can drop a few of them right here. Or all. There he is. Alright, he better... Go down the next time I hit him or we're in big trouble. Oh, I didn't even look at my clothing. Oh no. Bed rolls at 67. Where are we? Alright. Oh, that was not smart. I really hope he goes down. Uh oh, it's on. <laughs> Here's where we find out. Oh, that was so stupid. I am such an idiot. I thought I'd have enough time to take off a couple pieces of clothing so he didn't ruin them, just in case. What an idiot move that was. Well, we can say goodbye to a couple pieces of clothing now. For sure. I'm gonna bleed out soon. Okay. Alright, we're... Oh, he didn't die. Right by the fire. Thank you, sir. I'm afraid to look at my clothing. I only got two arrows. Oh, okay. Well, give me that one. All of a sudden, the bear's dead and that wolf is, like, all brave. I'm afraid to look at my clothing. It's going to be no good. Oh... Oh no. Oh, this is not good. Well. Alright, I need, do you know what I need? I need that. <laughs> Oh, that was seriously so stupid to try to take off my clothing there. Well, you can't get 
a kill much closer to your fire pit than this. <laughs> but it wasn't done the smartest. Alright, well, how can you be 6% frozen when we're inside of a cave where I'm warming up? a lot of days of food now. You know what? If I'm smart, I'm taking this off of you. Yeah, and I'm hoping that the uh, I'm really hoping that that bunker's not too far from where I'm at. I don't know where it's at. RA does. But, I mean, we don't even have mitts. And I had some mitts. Hey, what did I just do? I had mitts, but, uh, oh, I don't have a sewing kit. There we go. We have fishing. Tackle. So I have to hope that there's some clothing in there. Alright, and do I... I have two pieces of cloth. Well, we're going to get more out of these. That's terrible. My poor work pants. So the general location is when you first enter, take a left, and you follow it not too far. You use the prepper bunker and cave that overlooks. Oh, that's right by the entrance. Well, that's not too bad. I hope there's something good in it, like clothing-wise. I like seeing that moving up a bit. Better get rid of these before that wolf gets, uh, whoops, gets some ideas. Uh, you're cured already, but we'll just put you down anyway. We got colorful skies, but I don't think that's an aurora. If you remember rightly. <laughs> Ooh, should be a workstation as well. Oh, I hope so. Oh, look, at we got an aurora. Well, that was quick, wasn't it? <laughs> like an aurora flashed by and then said, nah. All right, uh, definitely need to make that because we are all out of it. Make that just to get it out of there. And you're frozen. And where's my meat? Oh, 
Okay, now we have the Aurora. Thing is, so I can't... I think I'd be almost dumber to go out in this Aurora than I was to try to take my clothes off while the bear was charging. So unfortunately... I think the smartest thing will be to sleep. And I'm... If this bear despawns, I'll flip. Alright, we got some condition. Now, do I have meat still? No. Yeah, I think I have to heal up a little bit before we go. Alright, well, we're in the safety of our cave, so we can just do... This... Five hours. What affliction do I have? Oh, did I forget to use that? I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. All right, I got to drop all this before that wolf comes in. Yeah, we'll have to wait for the next one. Wrong treatment? What is this? Oh, I need a reishi. <laughs> Good eye, Murdback. <laughs> Obviously, I'm on top of my game today. Well, may as well sleep. So all that condition I regained, I lost. Wow. It might take a while to get this condition back. All right, we have no cured guts yet. Um, just looking. Make sure I don't have stink on me. Actually, do I have clothing that needs to be repaired or can be repaired? Well. Uh, let's go outside. And maybe it won't be too cold. Back to 14 arrows. That's three. And I got one of those. I would like to have two of them. Yeah, Ray, you missed uh, my stupidity, I think. He attacked us in the in the cave as well. Cause I'm an idiot. <laughs> I 
I tried taking uh, I was gonna take a couple pieces of clothing off before dealing with him but it took too long it's dusk, so I can't and he came in and attacked us let's take those and let's uh continue with our stupidity and we'll try to light a fire without a torch this time so yeah he attacked us and then i shot him and he actually come didn't on. die come on and then i shot him again and he dropped here But we have a ton of meat. I don't want to burn all my coal on cooking this meat though. That's why I went outside was my hope was that I could take down a, uh, a tree limb. And we got all this basically except for the 0.5. But yeah, all right, you can't, uh, you can't plan it any better than that, eh? <laughs> I mean, aside from all the other stuff. He ended up right where I wanted him. I want all my sticks, though. So. Whoops. I can pick up lots more sticks. I just don't want to waste all my coal. Yeah, we got that wolf again that's going to need to be dealt with, but I don't really want to until my condition is higher. Because one bite could just take me out at this point. Going to need more sticks. All right, I'm gonna take a little bit of a break, just maybe two minutes, maybe three, and I'll be right back. So I hope you guys stick around.
ไปนั่งแบบโอ้ดูกันเหรอฮึมโน้ตว่าฉันไม่มีน้ำเหลือโอ้ไม่เป็นอย่างที่ฉันต้องการทำฉันทำได้ Seems if I click on my mouse in the wrong spot, I get a double click. See, just like that. Like what? Yeah, it's lucky I found all that coal, but it, like, you know me, right? <laughs> I'm a cheapskate. I don't want to use all my coal on this bear. I want to save it for when I really need it. I moved that piece of bear meat right to where I need to put this one. Four minutes. I think I'll keep making some water here. Again. Oh my. You can be cheap on the coal like that too. Get over 200 pieces at your Pleasant Valley base at the farmhouse. Yeah. See, and I, I did that a while ago where I was building rock caches outside the, the caves. And uh, every time I went through the caves, I'd throw my coal in there. And then I accumulated so much of it and never touched any of it. And those those rock caches hold like a hundred pieces. And then, you know, somehow I get dazzled by that big number and I don't want to use any of them anymore. Alright, what do I got for water now? One more. Alright, that should be enough water. Misers, yeah. <laughs> He who dies with the most coal wins. <laughs> There, I used some of my coal. I really don't want that wolf to come in. Because he will mess us up. You want to write in the snow, I'm still alive, or something like that? <laughs> That's funny. I'm gonna eat this one. Alright, well, 
we don't have an aurora and it's almost morning now. Looks like we're almost done cooking this. Still got that deer to cook up too, but I think that can wait. We're going to be sleeping through most of the day. And then just one more piece. 50, 56. That'll do it. And we'll take you, I guess. 56, 40. Uh, let's just go right there. We can snuggle with the bear. here. And I wouldn't mind taking out this wolf just so I don't have to worry about him. Oh, I need one more of these, right? Yes. I see a stick. Please show me another stick. There's another one. All right, now we'll go back. Why is the fish so heavy? I don't know. I've talked about that before. Like the fish are, they're so heavy. They have a lot of calories, but it, it seems like whenever I eat a fish, I'm eating almost the whole thing. Like it doesn't, uh, doesn't seem to work the same way as a uh, piece of regular meat. I'm 
What do we got? Let's do one more and then we'll go to bed. Let's not take chances. Alright, that was a pretty awesome place to drop it. Oh, that's where we got attacked, alright. <laughs> alright, I'll bring my bedroll back to where I like it. If I can. There we go. And we'll go 10 hours. Yeah, meat flavored bed. No eating in bed. All right, well, we got half of our condition. Snow if the hypothermia wouldn't kill me. I got a bunch of water, that's good. So yeah, alright, here's I took off the rabbit hat so it didn't get ruined, but we lost our rabbit gloves and our Bella Clava and our good pair of pants. And are we going to get an Aurora tonight? Oh, you know what? I mean, who honestly, who wants to watch somebody that's like really good at this game and really smart? You want to watch somebody who's an idiot, right? more exciting when the person's a moron. Let's go hunt this wolf. Where is he? Oh, I guess he's not coming out. So I will save our heat and we'll just pass an hour. Are you going to give us one? Because, yeah, I'll feel so much safer with that wolf not there. I think I would just prefer to do it in the daytime where I know I can see him. If he comes from the wrong spot, he'll blend in with the trees and I'll probably get attacked again. Uh, we'll just pass time. Still no Aurora. Where's all my meat?
Oh, you know what I should do? I should grab some coal just so I don't forget. Oh, I thought I was hearing Aurora music. I was hearing the game music. Alright. This stream will go a little over the two hours, depending. Um, I want to find that bunker in this stream. Conditions moving up, that's good. All right, we can sleep a little bit longer. It's not quite daytime. I'm gonna do that. Let's keep an eye on these. All right. Now we're gonna go hunt ourselves a wolf. And are any of these, oh, 96, 97. Well, we're getting closer to being able to repair our rabbit toque or a rabbit hat. What's its condition at right now? 19. We need a deer hide for those and we need leather for this, right? We don't want to lose that. But Mr. Wolf. Your time has come. There you are. Let's go, bud. Just gonna keep an eye on this. And we'll run back here and warm up. I don't want to lose any condition. Twenty one minutes. Oh, we might lose a bit, just a touch, but maybe we won't. No, we won't. We're good. And ninety eight. Here, Mr. Maple, let's uh, put you right there. And let's throw you right there.
You're our edible piece. All right, uh, I guess let's go collect some wood. Well, let's uh, get our temperature back first. Just a big old fluffy bear. So I might be wrong, but I think I lost an arrow with this guy. Because up on the... When I first shot him... Did I shoot him two times at least, right? And then I shot him twice in the cave, and I think I only got three arrows back. And I don't think any of them broke. Although you're getting real close. Look at our bows. See, this is why I have three bows. That's our good one. And it's down to 43. So we're getting into... I mean, we still got a ways to go before... We have to worry about needing a bow desperately, but... Alright, doesn't seem to be any limbs that way. I can take you down because you're not really doing anything. I'm gonna leave all of those ones though. we'll throw the sticks here. We'll pass time for an hour to warm up. There we go. Do I have a piece still? No. I want to keep my uh, food and drink as high as possible. We got a little bit on us, okay. I like having this stuff out here though, just so they can't run straight in. But that piece I took down wasn't doing anything, so... Uh, there's some old man's beard over there, so I might grab that so I can have an extra. I got two... Well, I only have one made. And I can make one more. This way I can have two made and one... ...in parts. Because, man, do I hate looking for it when I need it. Ah, oh, man. So, how would you guys rank me taking my clothing off when a bear is charging in... I mean, I'm sure you've seen me do other things that were stupid, but where does that rank in the level of stupidity? Is that, like, right up there, or... Have you ever seen me do something else that was maybe dumber? Because I'm struggling to think of anything else that was possibly worse than that. That was just... wow. I mean, it ended up working out in the end, but... I mean, the bear placement is just perfect. But it came at a cost. 
Yeah, RA, he was attack. Well, he was charging, but I didn't think he would get here as quickly as he could. So I came out here and I'm like going here and I took off my hat and I looked and he was too close to draw. I'm like, oh, what an idiot. So my main thing was like I had my bedroll on the ground. So if I did get attacked, it wasn't going to get hurt. And uh, I thought, well, if I can get my rabbit hat off, that'll be great. So, again, if I did get attacked, I mean, my rabbit hat was at 24 or something like that, so he would have shredded that. Oh, there we go. And we can repair you. You're up at 74. You're out of the woods now. We got a cured deer hide. We can repair our boots now. But yeah, I'll tell you, it was not one of my smartest moves. <laughs> It would have, it would made, maybe wouldn't have been so bad had I done it before I went outside of the cave and, and, you know, spurred the attack, but, or spurred on the charge, but, yeah, losing your mitts and, well, yeah, that's the other thing too is, uh, where is it? Right here, we're we're back down to improvised hand wraps because he shredded our our rabbit skin uh, mitts. All right, you know what? We're close. I'm just gonna sleep for a couple hours here. Yeah, and we're down a pair of pants. All right, give me an Aurora. I don't want to go too far. I'll just sleep another hour. Are you going to not give us an Aurora? again. I would love to have one. Well, it doesn't look like we're going to get one. Seems like a nice night. <laughs> Screw YouTube and get the bunker. <laughs> well, both of you are from YouTube, right? I know RA is. Murdback, did you, did you first find me from YouTube or did you come here? Actually, do I have meat on me? No, I don't. Yeah, you came from YouTube? Okay. Hmm. I don't want to leap and waste the, you know, there's always a chance that you get a late that an Aurora comes in late, but... I'm kind of hearing sounds, but I don't know. No, it's not that. Oh, 
Oh, you watched yesterday's on YouTube? Cool. Hmm. Well, I think at this point... I may as well sleep the rest of the night, but at the same time... I've seen Aurora's kick in later than this. I don't think it's going to happen, though. Yeah, and I prefer, actually, I, I was looking it up to see, like, if uh, watching the Twitch video on demand, if that actually does anything for the streamer. And from what I can tell, it really doesn't. But the views on YouTube help the YouTube channel. So anyone watching this, if you ever miss uh, the live stream and actually want to watch the video, I would really appreciate if you went over to YouTube and watched it there. Just the two, the two platforms just have such different ways of how they benefit or what benefits the person. And on YouTube, it's all about views and interactions. And on Twitch, it seems like if you're not there for the live stream, you may as well go watch it somewhere else. Well, we're freezing. So... I'm freezing too. I got my window open in my gaming room because it's been so hot the last few days and it is not hot today. It is f a little bit chilly and rainy outside and I am freezing. I'm literally like shivering right now. I think we're going to make some water. Come on, little fire. So yeah, with uh, uploading the videos to YouTube, there's uh, like I, I when I'm finished, I export it directly but there's a couple of problems with that the first problem is um i can't edit out that intro of starting soon it usually doesn't give me the option to do that until about an hour or so later and then i try to edit that as best as possible And the other thing is, like, yeah, definitely give it a few hours to uh, let YouTube process it enough that you can actually watch it at its full quality. And there is no time limit on that. Depends on how long the video is. It, Depends on what the YouTube traffic is like. It's about five degrees Celsius and windy where you're at. Yeah, it's pretty much that here. Oh, it's nine degrees. Or twice as warm as you. <laughs> I'm 
gonna make a bunch of water. Pretty much as much as I can make, I think. 15 and partly sunny. That's not a bad temperature. I've often said I would love to find a place that is uh, 15 degrees Celsius year round. I'm not greedy. I don't need it to be stifling hot. I've been to hot places and I can't stand it. You shower in the morning and like you come out of the shower. We have it here where we get those heat waves where it's above 30. Sometimes it's like uh, 35 or something. You go have a shower. You come out of the shower and like 10 minutes later you're sweating. And you just feel disgusting. So I don't require massive amounts of heat. I would just love to not have a, a temperature swing from, you know, where I live, the temperature can go anywhere from uh, about minus 30, sometimes a little worse, but I'm being realistic, minus 30 to plus 30. I'll take that happy medium. I'll just give me 15 degrees Celsius every day. What do we got? We got those guys. Should I just pack up my stuff and go over to that uh, that bunker you were saying? This might be a yet another very bad idea, but I mean, instead of sitting here being boring, why don't we, uh, well, how much weight do we got? We can take two more. I'll leave the uncooked meat here. <laughs> That's where you wait. It could be a bad but fun idea. Well, I believe this bear is this bear. So in terms of smell, we should be okay. I mean, three bars, we can obviously drag in wolves from further out, but... I'm pretty confident that I can uh, deal with them. I think it would just be more exciting than just watching me sit there and twiddle my thumbs. Now I just have to... Oh, I have to climb that rope. To get up to where I need to be. That's okay. Well, we won't have any problems with that. Did I say I hate being cold? Because I really do. And yeah, we're going to lose a little bit of condition on this. That's the rope over there, isn't it? Looks like it. Probably shouldn't run. Is that a rope or was I just seeing the crack of the... between the rock? Yeah, I don't think that's the rope right there. 
I think it's in there. Should be a rope uh, wolf on the top at the top of the rope, if memory serves. Yeah, I think there is. There's also that cave up there. There's the rope. So once I climb this, we can go warm up in that cave. All right, I will eat up. Should have ate that one. Oh, that's perfect, actually. Just eating the meat, we got rid of the sprain risk. And we don't really care about our alertness. Although coffee might not have been a bad idea just to make sure I can get all the way up this. Because I don't trust that I can. Alright. Um... This is not a good idea, but I needed my stamina back. I'll just go in this cave and sleep. We'll warm up in there. We'll go eight. Hey, Mr. Coach, welcome in. You're late to the party, but you caught up on watching. Nice. I get some drink in and then I'll eat again. my bedroll. Alright, weather weather doesn't sound so good, but I don't think I can get lost where I'm going. I don't think. I hope. <laughs> I think it's a pretty straight yeah I think it's it kind of funnels you right there anyways right I need some mushrooms to get back that tea I had to drink <laughs> All right. Coach comes in swinging. So <laughs> That's the guy who lost falling in the ice. Nice. Wow, it's already, we're already freezing.
Gachigasm. There's a word I've never heard in my life. All right. There we go. We're already here. That's good. Obviously no Aurora tonight. I'm just going to double check. You had to look up what a tram was? Oh, we got coal. In the tram, just like a, well, my, my thought was that it was like a streetcar. It's a goddamn freezing. There's the bunker. Let's get in there. Is there anything in here? Just this bed that's plus three and what's ours? Ours is plus five I think it is, right? Plus three as well. Here, let's close this vent. It'll be close. It'll be nicer. <laughs> well, let's pick that up actually. And... can throw all those there. Rabbit can go there. Deer there. Bear can go there and the sticks can go here. And... I think the meat should go outside. I need to find some place to escape this cold. Yeah. That works better. Alright, where's the doorway? Right there. That'll warm us up. Hopefully the weather cleared up. Did. But man, it's so dark. I think we'll just spend the night here. Just past time.
Oops. <laughs> I didn't want you to hear me uh, swallowing my coffee. So yes, I was muted again. All right, where am I? We got to go up there. Do I have anything I don't need to be carrying? You know what? I don't need to carry. Somehow I double clicked there again. All right, we got one bow. We're going to be using that one anyway, so. That's fine. That's like a. That's a kilogram right there that we just dropped, so we should be all right. Now we'll go get the rest of our meat. And hopefully, oh, you know what? There we go. I'm just going to go in there and I'm going to warm up. This signal void really allows you to run a lot during the daytime now. Because now you don't really care as much about your day-night cycles. So I'll just warm up in here. Tried to cancel it right as it ended, so. the cave. I'll leave all the raw meat. I'll try to take as much of that cooked meat as possible. And we have coal, right? We got eight pieces of coal. Yeah, this bunker is really handy, but it's kind of in a bad spot. Alright, we don't know the wolf situation in these parts. Should be okay. At least we can see though, right? <laughs> That's on you, Murdback. I was looking at your comment. <laughs> oh. Well, all of our stuff is good. Sprained ankle, sprained wrist. Well, we better fix our wrist. <laughs> it's to my left? Okay. No worries, R.A. 
Well, you know what, Murdvac? My cave might actually be a better spot to be in because I don't have to climb that rope. Yeah, Murdvac just about killed me. <laughs> That's my fault. But I'm blaming you anyway. That was funny. As soon as I saw her get air, I thought, uh oh. <laughs> I hope it's not a long drop. Well, I can't run without fixing my ankle. Your map knowledge of Hush is appalling. It, mine's not that much better. This is a pretty confusing region, but we're already committed to going up top, so we may as well go up there. And we can sleep for a couple of hours. Uh, yeah, we'll just drink. Go six. All right. Thirty two, so we can take about thirteen. That'll be fine. And all of them are one kilogram, so that's fine. And what are we at? 4394. You know what? I don't need more than five coal, to be honest. We'll just do that. Well, that's unfortunate. I was hoping that that bear would have left an arrow somewhere that I just didn't see. But he didn't. Alright, so if... Uh, we're going to go back to that bunker there. And I guess I'm going to say if I don't get an Aurora tonight... We'll just end it. We'll have to deal with that tomorrow. Because we're at two hours, well, two and a half when I edited out the uh, starting soon. <laughs> yeah, the king is now the king. Officially. That looks like our garbage. Oh, we got a puppy over here. Get on the flat terrain so it's easier to take them out. Oh, we don't have to, it looks like. Or should I say sounds like. We'll go warm up in that cave right after we, uh... Well, I guess we do. All right, come on, bud. How 
How much are you? 4.8. Alright, we'll put those on. I know I should drink a coffee, but I don't have enough thirst. To really get the full benefit. So we'll just do what we did last time. get in here we'll sleep for you know what I'm only gonna sleep an hour just to warm up because I'd rather be closer to that uh, other bunker when it's daytime some clothing in this place. Pants, head, or hands? I'll be happy with any of those. I'll be happy if I can get there before I lose any more condition. Alright, we're almost there. I think we might make it without losing any. Or only just a very little. an aurora all right we'll drop all of our meat actually let's pick this up and then we'll drop everything else we'll pick up our bows Cured. I think there was only one cured gut in here. I don't think I need it though. Most of those are getting good. I 
haven't had a chance to do that yet. Oh, I left my water up there too. Yes, that's right. All right, we can break these down. Isn't it funny? I left that water right where I thought I wouldn't miss it. But then I missed it. <laughs> oh, the music kicked in, but I thought it was Aurora music. There we go. That is the sound. All right, we'll do this. We'll grab our water. And then we'll whip out our radio. Actually, that's making it harder for me to see. Wouldn't it be nice if the Aurora was warm? All right, I have to go down. I'll be honest, it, I'm looking at my condition and I'm wondering if I'm ever going to get it all back. I know I will. It just seems so far away right now. There's that blinding alert on the screen right in front of your face. Oh, you billy goated at the helicopter? I know this billy goat. I don't know that one, though. Okay, so I have to go this way. Not that way, right? I can't feel my hands. I learned my lesson. We'll go here first. Do I if I don't warm up soon? Ah, uh, my kingdom for some birch bark. Yeah, wouldn't it be funny if that cache was like right by the bunker I was at? Come on, let me up. Oh, that's just dirty. Let me up. Make me walk all the way around. going to test your moderation skills. <laughs> All right, let's not walk off any cliffs. I gotta go down here. I guess so, eh?
Oh, they're right here? Nice. There we go, we have this bunker. Alright, you can get put away. Bunker Gamma. Alright, I don't see anything of any interest. Yeah, I'm keeping my lantern out. Fishing the oh leather, perfect. And fix the uh, moose satchel. Oops. You can go up there. That's great. I saw some lantern fuel. I see that. I'm not going to read that yet. Oh, you're just paint. Another mag lens. That's okay. Got a soda. Oh, we can search these. Give ourselves some music. We have a little bit of a basement. Okay, I'm not going to read that either. Not yet anyways. I'll leave those for the last. yet. better than these. Not yet, but it will be. Alright, and then just some water, I guess. Alright, did I miss anything? Anyone? Aside from not reading the notes yet? I think I got it all, right? I guess we can uh, put that away and let's fill it up. And we will check out these. The island hasn't been making our lives any easier. Hauling loads from the coast to the inland bases has been slow and costly. And people are starting to notice our operation around the airfield and mine. It's getting harder to stay under the radar. 
but the character of the locals, both here and far inland, seems in our favor. There aren't any helping hands. Outsiders get ignored and then forgotten. And we play the part. All right, that's that. Just want to double check. You know what? I might need some more cloth to be repairing. And now this one. Session 14, Project Medical Officer interviewing Patient 7. Return to the first instance. What did you see? It was at the beach. Just pictures in my head, feelings. One of those beaches where the, the sand goes way down to the water, no drop off. I remember a, a gray day and dark water, no wind, no waves. I was alone, looking around a lot. I didn't understand what was happening. What, what do you think when you're that little? Always wondered why it was that day, that trip that stuck with me. Focus on the ending, the final frame. They lost me. Just a little kid. All right, so that is that. Uh, you were hoping for more clothes. Yeah, so was I. But you know what? We got one. Well, we got two pieces. Um, what should I repair first? The mitts? And those should be better than these now. Not much, but uh, we'll get a piece of cloth back out of it. So it's kind of like a free repair. This is only cotton, so I'm not going to waste it. But I'd like to get this repaired. Yeah, that would suck to lose that. And I think, uh, what are we going to eat and drink a little bit? May as well eat up the canned goods, right? And then we can drink. Now the bad thing about going up to that uh, that one cave is that I have to go up there to get I think some of my meat but that's not the end of the world I think we're doing pretty good now is there a bed in here did I miss a bed? Um, oh, and yes, we have this workbench, but you know what? I think I'll wait until I am back in Mystery Lake to uh, make some more rabbit skin gloves because I have... Uh, I have sewing kits. Oh, I missed that. Okay, there was nothing in there. Right, there's the bed over here. I have sewing kits there, so it'll take a lot less time to make the... Uh, uh, where are they? It's 10 hours with a sewing kit. What? It's 8 hours? Why does it take longer with a sewing kit than it does with fishing tackle?
Oh, but I need four rabbit pelts. Okay, well that does it all right there. Yeah, normally it takes longer with the fishing tackle. That's weird. Well, I guess uh, I, I'm gonna have a nap, I guess, in game. I'm gonna sleep in the top bunk because I'm cool like that. And I'll end the stream here. So I thank you all for joining me. Um, I'll be on... Uh, you know what? I think Wintermute is questionable today. I think. So, I'll be on again uh, tomorrow. For sure. 8.30am Mountain Daylight Time. We'll continue this. So, thank you all for joining me. And... Hopefully I'll see all three of y'all tomorrow. You guys have a great day, have a great night, and bye-bye.